I'm actually curious to see how much power this thing generates. Ah, we can do it. I wonder if there's a research round, too. And, wait for it. Hang on, where's that timber? Oh, it's on the other side. Hang on. I can actually... Oh, wow, you're a ways away from the base. Can you see me? Yeah. No, I can't. Uh, if you look to the base, look to your right about 20 degrees, 30 degrees. Uh, I don't think you... I'm up on top of a mountain right now. You should be able to see my marker. Nope, can't see anything. Just the base. Uh, okay, you're looking at the base. Okay, the, the mountain ridge, not the mountain just to the right, but the one to the right of that. That's where I am. Turn to your right a little bit. I can sort of see you moving, yeah. Right okay, a little. Now I can see you. Yes. I'm at the solar panel right now. I got a tether here, too. Unfortunately, we won't be able to get this back until we get the rovers. And I think you need the large rover to move this thing. I've never actually tried hooking one of these up to their base before. So I don't know how much power they actually generate, but I do know that you can use them. Oh, I can almost see it coming over the hill. Or not over the hill, over the horizon. Oh. Yeah, I actually went all the way around that mountain. I see you. There you are. So you should be able to see the solar panel, right? Uh, no, I can't see it yet. Yeah, I'm standing right next to it. It's a little bent. I think the mountain is blocking me. Like the foothills are. It should be, should be seeing it. It's right in front of me. Oh. Oh. You ready for this? See, and it, one of these ends, it's actually on the bottom here, if you look at it, it's got like little connections f on it. Yeah, I see that, and it's making power right now. Yep. Making a hell of a lot of power. See, we just hook it up to the rover and take it home, but we need the big rover for this. Can you actually... Yeah, you can. But you have to use the umbilical on the rover. Because the rovers can connect oh. to that connection. So we'd have to get the rover up here for it. Okay, well, we got the big rover. Uh, researched. Right. Er, no, we don't. It, that was the next thing in line. Alright, well, I actually got the big research pod just over there. You can probably see it, that little yep, sausage little thing. That's our 5500, that's our big payday right there. And that's about all I found. I found another seat too, and I'll probably take that with us. And it'd probably be quicker to go the other way, because I was going for a little while. But I'm going to go and grab this seat quickly. Yeah, 
Yeah, I'm gonna stay where I know there's air. Oh, I got tethers every with me. I have tethers on me as well. Uh oh. Dust storm. Where is it? Uh, we're good. We are yeah, good. We're, we're way good. Yeah. All right. So then let's go this way. Wait, hold on. Where's my tether line? Oh no, we gotta go this way. Sort of veered off track, trying to hunt this thing down. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. I gotta put a beacon there. And I'm gonna research the beacon. And I think that was relatively cheap, was it not? A hundred bytes. Alright. Alright, we're good. So, what does the beacon need? Compound. Uh, I'll be right back. I want to drop a I got some compound right here. Okay. Thank you. Because I want to go put a beacon down where that thing is. I think that's how these work. Aha, it is too. Okay. Just so we don't lose the solar panel. I'm sure well, there's another one somewhere, but we'd have to find that one. Actually, if you want to just take that button. Oh, oh, I got the seat there. I can juggle them, it's fine. Okay, yeah, because I want to go around the other side here and just see if I can find anything else. I started digging out a, uh, something, uh, a rack, but, uh, I started running low on air, so. Alright. Okay, can you see the, the beacon now? I give you a look. I cannot. You don't see a green dot? Okay, maybe it's only for me. Because I activated it. That could be it. Alright, where was I going? I was going over here. Let's, let's hook up. Hook up to the grid. And start exploring. Storms are brewing. Oh, goody, it's coming right this way. Yes, it is. Just go in a little hidey hole here for now. Do, 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 do. Whoa, <laughs> that was a close one. Oh. I watched it hit me too. The camera was in such a way that the camera was right where my head was. So I watched that, that block come flying into my little hidey hole and hit me right in the face. Well, I see the beacon. Ah, uh, storm's coming this way, so you might want to watch out. 
I get killed in the storm, I respawn back at the base just in time for that storm to roll in. Maybe it'll blow my body towards me. Christmas lights are okay, so that's all that matters. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, uh... I'm snagging some compound. I gotta go get my... my stuff back. Well, at least I can see the beacon for the solar panel. And the best thing is about those beacons is they're actually reusable. Whoa! A big drop there. I think we're gonna have to talk to somebody about these gophers. These holes are getting bigger and bigger. Alright, is this a chasm? Well, now that I know how to fill them in, it's, uh... <laughs> I was joking, I was joking. I think I'm responsible for some of those holes anyways. Uh, let's see. Well, oh, I can't even do that. don't have a canister. Damn it. Um... Uh... Any resin around? Resin. Resin, resin, resin. Hmm. There's some resin. Oh, our mushrooms all grown up now. And apparently, from what I've heard, uh, you know, the indestructible. 9709. On that one? On the man made one, yes. Wow. How long is it going to take? One hour and six minutes. <laughs> oh my god. 9,000. That's awesome. Well, we're almost to the large rover. Uh, all right. Uh, you know what? Well, I, I guess it doesn't really matter. We seem to be pretty good on the power situation, right? As far as like s the battery goes. Uh, I'm gonna. The battery we have blows. The only thing that's keeping us alive is the fact that we have a fuck ton of windmills all right well maybe let's hold off on the rover for the a moment and let's go for the large battery because we need six thousand for that uh because I think that one's going to hold the equivalent of possibly like 16 of those small ones. Because I think that would definitely help. Especially if we start having to research things that are going to take an hour. And if we start smelting yeah. a whole bunch of stuff. 
Uh, yeah, I'll go ahead and pull the trigger on that one. Alright. You can be mad at me if we fuck up later. You're like, God damn it, now we need that research. Oh, don't worry about it. We got ten grand cooking right now, so who cares? more research down here. Let's go take a little peek down here. I hope there's no despawn timer on uh, on your bodies. Oh yeah, I just remembered something too. Don't don't forget if we ever plan on get well when we plan on getting the shuttle going, we're gonna have to get the either the hydrazine catalyzer or uh, the fuel condenser. And I don't know how much those are gonna cost to research. It's okay, because I just got another one. Here I am trying to find my dead body, and I'm, I'm caving. Okay, enough of that. And I'm caving in a cave I've already been in. I'm out of tethers. Always out of tethers. Let's see the solar panel though. Hey. Oh. That almost killed me. Alright, where is compound? There was some over here. Oh, there was a close one. You starting to get lag spikes too, or is it just me? A little bit. Yeah, they're not like major, just like almost like a stutter. Sworn I saw a compound. I'm just not paying attention. Let's make a run for it. No. See if we can find a compound here. Quickly.
kind of funny now that I see it what one of the ramps that I built because the the system for for building them is kind of crappy it looks a lot like a dick uh, I never really pay attention to it <laughs> 